Okay, today is April 4th and this is Mr. Mario Folletto and he has a toenail that we just realized is grown into his pad. Can you get a close-up of that? So we are going to be clipping this toenail and we want to be sure that we're safe. So the things that you're going to need are peroxide, cotton balls, cat muzzle, nail clipper, okay, and some neosporin. So the cats usually get kind of angry when you put this muzzle on, so you don't want to be lingering. So I'm going to put this on and do this quickly so that I'm safe and he's safe. Okay, so there's our issue. Pull this away. It stinks. Can you smell it? Mm -mm. So I'm going to go halfway in, just like you would. It grows from the top to the bottom. So I can see the blood supply here. I'm going to go here, and I'm not going to get his pad. I'm just going to go quick. It might splinter. That's just part of it. I'm going to pull this out. And then I'm going to cut this little thing off if he'll let me. Okay. Then we're going to take the cotton balls right away before he touches anything. Use your cotton ball. Get saturated and you want to soak this little spot. And then I'm going to let the owner know that we need to take care of that issue. A little bit more. Can you get that full for me? Perfect, thank you. Make sure that peroxide gets in there. And he's allowing me to do this. He's not too painful yet. I'm guessing that this has been growing in for the last six weeks or so. And then I'm gonna cut this one here before he gets upset. Double check their their thumb area. Is that oops, sorry Mario. So that's all the time we had on him. So anyway, I'm gonna let the owner know that this needs some aftercare. I'm gonna put a little bit of neosporin on it. Do you mind telling the viewers why that's the time limit? On the cat? That's that's just what they give you. That's that's it. That's pretty normal, pretty typical. This is a wonderful, wonderful, well-behaved cat, but he is in a little bit of pain, and he's tired of me messing with him, so. Just remember, cut it halfway down, measure from the top, make sure you have a muzzle, and make sure you use cotton balls with your peroxide, and if there's a, you know, a big problem or infection that starts afterwards, bring your cat to the vet for antibiotics.